We're going to have a look at how to use custom cell formatting to create bullet points in Excel. Let's say I've got some bullet point text here in these cells. What I'm going to do is right click the first one, I'm going to go format cells, brings up this dialog box, under number I'll go to custom and in this type I'm going to type in the bullet point. I'll do that with the Alt 7, 7 being on the number keypad, space, a shift, and the at symbol. And you can see that's how it works. This is what it will look like when I press OK. So that's been very good. And I can do that with all these as well. If I right click and format cells, I can now, because I've entered the custom format once, I can go back to it. If I select the last one just entered and click OK. That will format the same way. Now let's say I have some other bullet point text on this side and I want to use the indent. Uh, let's say I want a level up here that's higher than the levels down here. What I could do, let's just do it this way, I'll, f I'll copy the formatting first using the Format Painter and I'll paint that over here. What I could do is select these text, uh, these bits of text, and go to the alignment tools and increase the indent maybe two times. Or if I wanted to, I could just define a new custom format. So again, I'll select that, right click, Format Painter paint that and on these ones I'll actually go right click format the cells uh, this time I'm going to create another custom format and here I'll add a few spaces let's add five spaces one two three four five insert a bullet point with alt 7 another space and the at symbol click OK and there you see We've got level 1 bullets and level 2 bullets. So that's how you can use custom cell formatting in Excel to create bullet points.